Cumulus Networks just released NetQ 1.1 and Host Pack. One of the new features with NetQ is checking and visibility into eVPN networks. I'm Diane Patton, Technical Marketing Engineer with Cumulus Networks. Today, I'm going to do a short demonstration showing how NetQ can help NetOps troubleshoot a network running VXLAN with eVPN. So let's say last week we recently installed a new rack, which consists of two new leaf switches, leaf 3 and leaf 4, and two new servers. All devices have NetQ installed and the servers have HostPack installed. Tonight we added the new leaf switches to the current eBGP unnumbered network. We also added the VXLAN overlay network running the eVPN control plane to the new rack. The hosts are running MLAG to the switches. Now as we're getting ready to go home for the night, the application team just called. They are adding applications to the new servers but are experiencing intermittent connectivity between server 1 and one of the new servers they named server 4, and they're not sure why. In the past, NetOps would first study the network diagram, and then they'd have to tell it around, checking connectivity and routing tables on the VXLAN overlay. But with NetQ, all of this can be done from one central location with a few short commands. So let's go to the demo. As you can see, the apps team gave us access to server one, so we will do all the commands from here. But this could be done from anywhere in the network, including the telemetry server console. We tried to ping, but as you can see, we were unsuccessful. So first, let's see which switches the new server, server four, is connected to within NetQ, server four, show, LDP, uplink. So we can see it's connected to two new leaves, leaf three and leaf four. Next, let's check the data plane to make sure that's okay. We know the MAC address of the remote server we are trying to access, server four. So we can do a NetQ, trace, then the MAC address, and then we'll do it from leaf two. So we can see here that we have dual paths through the network that traverses two spine switches as expected. The green is the VXLAN overlay, the blue is the VTEP, and the black is strict layer two. So let's do the same thing from leaf one, and that looks good. So next, let's check BGP with a NetQ, check BGP, and we can see everything looks fine with BGP. And then finally, let's do a quick check on eVPN. Oh, it seems Advertise All VNI was accidentally not configured on Leaf 4. So let me go and quickly add that command. Okay, so let's try that NetQ command again. That looks good now, and let me try to ping again. And that worked. So as a resolution, the network engineer very quickly found the misconfiguration and could go home sooner. By not advertising the VNIs from one of the leafs, sporadic connectivity resulted for server-to-server -server communication between the racks, depending upon which leaf was used as a server's gateway. So in summary, NetQ along with HostPack supports effectively troubleshooting overlay networks on both the VXLAN data plane and the eVPN control plane. It will also check eVPN configurations to ensure that all is operating as expected. By deploying host pack, all the troubleshooting can be done from the servers as well. We showed only one example of NetQ that made operations go much more smoothly, effectively, and save time, but there are many more. So schedule a free demo, download our demo on GitHub, or try it out on Cumulus in the Cloud today to see more. Thank you for watching and have a great day.